the kinsman maiden hurdle is next. And once again, we've got a field largely made up of newcomers. That's the two with experience in this to give us a bit of a gauge, make the handicapper's life a little bit easier when it comes to handicap. It's a three mile two foil maiden, so this is about as far as they go over the timber. Expressway for Padraig Hogan, Laura's Trees, and Optimistic Gale for James Shea, Patricia's Brig for Stu Gray, Ella Kiss Angel for Padraig Hogan, and Pepe Militrian for Daniel French. There, the newcomers Salad Bar for Martellino and Stolen Princess for Leon Van Rensburg are the two with form, so away they go then. And Salad Bar pulling for its head and Stolen Princess to the two who've got experience are the two that have gone to the fort. Pulling for its head there is Expressway on the inside, one of the two Padraig Hogan runners. There's two James Shays in this as well, so bringing in two, both of those two bringing in two new three milers at this point. There's no guarantee, also, they are definitely hurdlers. They might be chasers just having a spin over hurdles this week to get a handicap mark. Who knows? They get over the second, and then all safely over the second with Stolen Princess the leader. The rest of them are pretty much in a, in a group. Almost virtually in a line. The stolen Princess is showing the way past the winning post. Two more circuits of the track to go. And Stolen Princess in the lead. Wins by a couple. It could be argued for thinking this is almost a penalty kick. All of Leon Van Rensburg, the leading trainer, up against all of these newcomers. And Salad Bot. Uh, who knows what the newcomers are going to be like Salad Bar's got a little bit of decent form as well so Stolen Princess then into the third is over it nicely from Patricia's Brig who's moved into second and Pepe Miletrian is after that and we'll safely over that one as well Salad Bar just dropping to the back of the main group and Optimistic Gale finding the pace just a little bit hot Hard to believe in a three and a quarter mile hurdle, but it's Stolen Princess in the lead. My good four to Expressway second, and Pepe Meletrian, Patricia's Brig, and Laura's Trees as they skip over the fifth. All safely over the fifth. The Stolen Princess clearing the lead. Running along nicely. Skips over flight number six. We'll so for the other one or two, a little bit untidy, but no serious mistakes. And Stolen Princess continues to lead then from Expressway on the inside of Pepe Meletrian. And on the outside is Patricia's Brig in the black colours. In green on the inside of that one is Laura's Trees. Then the second Padre Hogan. Also on the inside is Ella Kiss Angel in the yellow. The Crimson Maroon of Salad Bar is next, and then a gap to the back marker. A gap of three lengths to Optimistic Girl, who's over the seventh. And we're racing towards the eighth. We'll nicely over that one as well. There's still a long way to go. You can see the stand in the distance. And again after they get past it and the Stolen Princess continues to lead by three to Expressway and Pepe Meletrian who've been pretty much side by side all the way through the race in comes Salad Bar has moved through into fourth the leader was a little bit messy over that one and the lead is down to two now Optimistic Girl starting to struggle out the back maybe she's a four miler another three miler they pass the winning post then and they've got a, uh, a furlong to go they've got a circuit to go and it's Stolen Princess in the lead. By two lengths to Expressway second. It's pulled away from Pepe Meletrian now. He's now been joined by Salad Bar. Then comes Laura's Trees and Elicus Angel with Patricia's Brig just behind them. And then now out of shot and somewhere adrift from the rest of them. Optimistic girl. And you would have to be very optimistic if you thought that one was going to play a part in the finish. And it's Stolen Princess who at the moment not sure to be doing so. It's two lengths clear. Salad Bar has now moved through into second. Expressway is third. And Ella Kiss Angel and Laura's Trees as they get over the 11th. 
Cleppy Malletrian's just dropping back. And then you got Patricia's bringing optimistic gale behind her now. And they're still. Quite well strung out, they've got less than a mile to race. And Stolen Princess has been in the lead all the way. Final Expressway is now back in second. Salabar is in third. Then in fourth, Elekis Angel, who looks to be going well. Then comes Laura's Trees there, pulling away a little bit from Pepe Maletri and Patricia's Brig. An optimistic gale is somewhere adrift off the rest of them. Over the 12th they go. There's four more flights to take then now. And Stolen Princess is still clear. Salabar in second as they get over that fourth from home. And Salabar is now coming up to join Stolen Princess. So the two with the experience are five or six lengths clear of the rest of them who are headed by Elekis Angel there. Although on the outside, Laura's Trees is starting to get going, but it looks like it's going to be a battle between the two experienced horses at the moment. Then it's Stolen Princess and Salad Bar. They're about eight lengths clear of Expressway and Laura's Trees and Elekis Angel. Over the third last they go, and Stolen Princess has been in the lead all the way. Salad Bar is trying to close. They can concentrate on these two. The rest of them are pretty much out of it as they come down towards the second last. Then Stolen Princess and Salad Bar. Stolen Princess on the far side gets over it in the lead. Salad Bar a bit slower over it in second. One more flight to take, two furlongs to race, and it's Stolen Princess in the lead. Salabar is trying to close, trying to run on his expressway, but these two are having a ding dong battle towards the final flight. It's Stolen Princess in the lead. Salabar going up on the outside to try and poke her nose in front the first time that Stolen Princess has been headed. It's Salabar and Stolen Princess racing towards the final flight, then there, and Salabar gets over in the lead. Stolen Princess has suddenly got nothing left, and Salabar is in front, but Stolen Princess switches to the outside and she's starting to run on again. Salabar needs a line to come and it does just in time. Salabar takes it. Stolen Princess second, Expressway third, then Laura's Trees and Patricia Brig. And all the way back to Pepe Maletrian with Optimistic Gale pulling up at the back. And Salabar just hanging on from a renewed challenge from Stolen Princess. It changed his legs and switched to the outside and it nearly gave it that little bit of burst it needed to get back into the lead. Oh, Salabar needed almost all of that three and a quarter miles and then didn't need the last bit. So Salabar takes it for Martin Leader, a stolen princess for Leo van Rensburg second, Expressway for Badrang Hogan third, Laura's Trees for James Shea was fourth, and Patricia's Brig for Stu Gray was fifth.